Today we're doing something really exciting at Hacksmith Industries. It's a long time coming and it's right behind this door. Come with me. Are we getting a new room? Just a new wall for to power loader. Yeah. Does it feel nice? It does. Is it bittersweet that you're gonna destroy this right after you make it? No, it's just sweet. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> we're gonna have a wall, and then we're not gonna have a wall. I don't think we can show that. I keep dropping screws. Oh <laughs> no. There we go. Woo! The mastermind behind this monstrosity. What's that uh, missile for? Um, I mean, it's just for the video, but it looks pretty cool. So you're gonna just, you know, hang it up there as a prop after we're done. Nice. You know, have a Jericho laying around. No big deal, classic hacks with industries fashion. What's the power loader doing with the missile? Um, I think we're just moving it around. Are you driving it when it goes through the wall? I don't actually know. I'm kind of kind of sketched out by that. I really don't want to get impaled by a metal two by four. But um, this thing still scares me. Mm. But Ben, you're making it safe, right? Safe. I'm making it as safe as it can be. If Ogden wants to run into a brick wall, he can still do that. My code can't stop him. <laughs> but what in theory my code should do is preventing him from crushing himself with the arms. Hopefully. I've been doing all my testing with the remote because it's safer and a whole lot sketchy. So if anyone takes this remote, they can control the power loader. They can, but if I have this button, I can stop the power loader. What is this? Uh, it's a box from the power loader. There's a quick scene in the movie where you can see the power loader's actually moving crates around. So we had this uh, uh, box laying around for a very long time. It's just outside. So I have fabricated some uh, grumpy boys, as I call it, in the files. And the power loader is going to grab onto it right here, and this is a uh, 1 8 mild steel. Nice. So hopefully it doesn't break. What's your role in this, Tyler? Uh, I'm going to try to get some good social clips, because uh, it's not every day that you go to work and a power loader crushes through a like, 16 foot wall, so it should be pretty exciting. Are you the pilot for this? I am. Gonna Gonna go wash my hard hat because I don't want drywall falling on my head. Wait, like, here's my plan. Here's my plan. Technically speaking, I should be able to bust through this with my shoulder. So as long as I don't get stabbed with a stud, I should be fine. So if I put my two hands out here, when I drive through, I can grab the studs and hopefully keep myself alive. We'll see. We'll see if it's a good plan in about an hour. <laughs> so what's gonna happen is power loader is gonna get started up back there. We're gonna roll this looping video of the logo only and at any time after a few seconds we're gonna have the power loader drive straight through. Bogdan, you know that once you're through, basically as soon as you're through you can stop. That doesn't mean we're gonna stop rolling so you keep your energy up. We'll scream at you when to stop the energy. In terms of safety, first of all that wall can collapse at any moment, either forwards or backwards depending on how the power loader drives through it. First, so let's keep this entire area clear. We've got two people with these stops. Rob. Other than that, I want everybody wearing safety glasses because there's gonna be shrapnel drywall flying everywhere. Um, yeah. Okay, everybody, let's roll our cameras. Lights off. Rolling. Let's get, our, let's get into beauties. Okay, so I'm shooting beauties here, so yeah. I'm gonna have to take one of these cameras and throw them on a gimbal. But then we're shooting other stuff that we'll need multicam. We'll shoot multicam when we get into the test. But before that, not really. 
Tyler, that was crazy. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. I'm glad Bogdan's okay. Got some good, good photos of it. Foggy, mic up. Do it. Do you want Foggy wearing lab coat still? Yeah. Yeah. Do you want me wearing a little bit? Of course. And start with your turn towards the. Wow. I can't believe it's finally done. It is absolutely insane to see this giant 11 foot mech standing in front of me being ready for some destruction. Of course, it would not have been possible if it wasn't for everyone at Hacksmith Industries, our project partners, and of course, all of you guys, the viewers, the Patreons, and the channel members. Thank you for making this happen. Well, now that we have it, uh, what's it good for? <laughs> We're gonna recreate the Elon Musk gaze on the first successful SpaceX rocket. He's like, ah, that's me, with parallel. And the panda. And the pa- What the? <laughs> Are you driving the power loader? Nice. What scene is this? This is scene six. When they open the box. What's in the box? What's in the box? Hands. Hands? More wax hands. Oh, uh, you. No, uh -huh. but that's actually how I got this. Through the wax hand people. This is just coming out of like that Wayland video, so it, it's it's a hard cut, really. So, and then, and then, do you want me to talk to you while we're cutting out of the open there? Yeah, you guys just talk yeah. as you cut. Okay, James, what's in the box? Yeah. Great, I gotta build another power loader. Awesome. Does this look familiar? As you can see, the scale is a, a little bit. Ready? Yeah. For, uh, so this is the right foot? No, no, no. <laughs> this is my left foot. Look how much they're... Good! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! But, enough about the props. That's the thing now. Let's do it's it. It's a real power. Excellent. Cut. Cool. Alright, so uh, it turns out the cornstarch-based peanuts Stick like glue with water. So Owen doesn't know this yet, but we're gonna we're gonna grease him up and put him in this box, and then he's gonna become the peanut man. No, ew. <laughs> Do it, Bogdan. What, what's happening? He's trying to draw my shoes off so that the corn starch comes off. And if you guys want a piece of history and want to help support projects like this, make sure you head over to Axel's store and pick up the power loader T-shirt and our new lab coat. Kinda. No. <laughs> Look, it's a cat. Let's get the missile. Ready? Tyler, what's this? Uh, it's what's a in your hand. Self-destruct button. <laughs> Destruction. Destruction. Turn it up. Yeah, let's do this. Wait, wait. Say the thing. Uh, cue the intro. Coffee of the day, starting now. <laughs> no, no. no it's 
Um, so Bogdan's gonna drive the power loader. It's gonna come into here. He's gonna turn, pick up this cool box full of Paxmith.store gear, bring it out, and drive it back. That's all we need. Nice. It's gonna look sweet. And action! the base. We're not gonna pick up by the base. No? No. Because it, it's not gonna hold. The pipe is gonna break. Oh yeah. And then Bogdan just like comes out of nowhere. Get away from him, you <laughs> And then grabs him. Like this is close up to the head? Yeah. I'll be tight on James then. Power loader's gonna come in. Yeah, tight on James is great. Do you know what you're saying? Yeah. <laughs> great. And action. All right, this is freaking awesome. It's amazing seeing this. Let's not start with, all right, this is freaking awesome. But that's what I'd say, I Daryl. know, it's too much. <laughs> Try something new. Three years in the making, and this project is everything I've ever dreamed of. So, we've got an incredible surprise for you guys. A Xenomorph head. Get away from him, you Okay, cut. Action! Turn it on. I don't know, it's madness. <laughs> He's gone mad. <laughs> We're stuck in the mud. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who's stuck in the, the mud? The forklift. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. At least 25 is, minutes now. Oh yeah, this is like, honestly, this is like... So this guy's gotta go over here then. Okay. Ah, but then... I'll go back here on the face. Yeah. That's not great though, because we got we're gonna be looking straight into the sun. Am I gonna be pretty dead on? No, I mean for the wide.
everything you oh wish god, for. Oh god, this is so cathartic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy slash sad. This is amazing. <laughs> what an incredible, like a crazy, amazing send off for this thing. Yeah, yeah. Like, who gets to have their car destroyed by a robot? That's just the coolest thing ever. Yeah, it's a flag. <laughs> it's not not good for that. I should have parked closer to that end of the parking lot. <laughs> you parked the white one? It's the white one. Hey guys, I changed my mind. I kind of wanted the car back. <laughs> Isn't that cool? <laughs> All right, roll camera. Roll camera? Roll camera, the power loader's coming. Oh, where are we? We're, we're out on the street, and if you look down there in a couple of minutes, something's gonna be coming around the corner. <laughs> oh, hey, hey. How's it? It's going pretty good, we're just here for a double-double. <laughs> They forgot the legs. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out the merch, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Ah! Ah!